Good evening, Master Tanak. Good evening. Good evening to everyone here. Good evening. I am King Davi, and with much gratitude, I accept this invitation. I come here to bring information that I consider to be pertinent to the growth of all of you. Of course, the history is told according to the belief of the person who wrote it. As your master himself was describing it to you, it has always been done this way, and it was no different with me. When I governed, I did have an innate characteristic in my being, and this characteristic often bordered many people, because when we are here to obey the laws of God, we are indeed inconvenient for many people. The rules, they are clear. The rules, they were made by human beings, so they were meant to be obeyed by human beings. But when we have the consciousness that we are children of God and that we have a commitment to fulfill, we will not obey the rules of human beings. We will fulfill the laws of God. This was my behavior, to fulfill the laws of God. But what does this mean? What does it mean to fulfill the laws of God? The laws of God, they are clear. They carry the mean of responsibility, of respect, of energy for yourself and for your next. Because all your attitudes, they must be directed from an awareness of being God. And when you have the consciousness that you are God, all your energy starts to be managed by this consciousness. So I tell you that when you reach the level of consciousness of being God, you will be within the laws of God. And no matter how much you want to, no matter how hard you try, you will not be able to act differently because this is a factor that brings a greatness of being. The historical facts don't matter. Of course, if we go into details, we will bring up many things. But I say that today, at the stage you are at, that what will be brought up will not bring you any benefit, will not add any knowledge to you. What's important for all of you to observe is your own behavior. Because I, by being a king, I was, yes. I will say, I led to have a pattern of behavior because there is already an established standard for a king's behavior. But what does king mean for each of you? In history, king is a position, I will say, as you know it today, like a social position. But for me, king is God. King is the one who governs everything and the one who governs everything is God. Who gives life is God. Who gives energy is God. So, King is God. Although I am known as King Davi, I am simple Davi. I am simple, a son of God. And that's what you must observe. Because it doesn't matter who you are today within this society. It doesn't matter. These are just nomenclatures that you have established within this consciousness that's here today ruling the planet Earth as it has always been this way. And this is why I say nomenclatures don't matter. It matters that you are simple a child of God. And the only king that exists is God. If you have this consciousness, and take this stance, your lives, they will be led, I will say, within this corridor. I will put it in this way, that will lead. You are directly to your destiny, and your destiny is to live the life of God. Everyone is God. But God, He is not outside of you. God is inside you. This is why, when I was called King Davi, I accept it with gratitude, because God, who is the King, He lives in me, so 
I am King Davi. So, observe that this consciousness is what you all must have, because if you don't have this consciousness, you will never reach the level you desire, because it is this consciousness that makes your energy, yes, flow in the way it is created, because life was given to each one of you, and this is the only way for you to show appreciation for life. So, with much love, with much respect, I say goodbye. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.